Before performing your inspection, you have to calibrate the UT payload. The calibration does one thing, it finds how fast the sound travels through your material. If you don't have any calibration block, you have to input the velocity manually. For that, select one point and toggle to sound velocity. Enter the value and press calibrate. Here's a table of the sound velocity in the main materials. If you have a calibration block, and you know exactly what is the thickness of the asset to measure, you can perform a one-point calibration on the exact same thickness. If there is no step at the exact same thickness, you can use steps that are close to it. A thickness difference of 10% is acceptable. If you're not sure about the thickness of your asset, or if your asset has different thicknesses, you should perform a two-points calibration choose two points that are above and below the range of thicknesses you have to measure. For example, if your asset has 8, 10 and 18 mm plates, calibrate your system on the 5 mm and the 20 mm step. Click on the two points button and enter the steps thicknesses. Then place the probe on the first step. Make sure the A-scan is stable and clean, and that the red lines are on two consecutive echoes. Press Calibrate. Then repeat the operation for the second thickness. To make sure the calibration was successful, check the date and time of calibration, and try to take a measurement on a different step of the calibration block. It's normal to get values that are plus minus 0.1, the expected one.